A great proportion of students find learning and motivational problems in courses that require critical thinking. This protocol is significant because it provides educators and researchers with guidelines to implement an approach that can be effective to face this challenge, the problem solving before instruction approach. This approach consists on, before explaining a concept in class, giving students the opportunity to invent personal solutions in relation to that concept. Also, this protocol is significant because it makes accessible an experimental evaluation about the efficacy of problem solving before instruction, integrating this evaluation with the real educational practice and attending to the variability of students in terms of capacities and motivational predispositions. The protocol is contextualized in a statistics class of variability. Concretely, the problem solving before instruction condition consists on having students to invent variability measures before they receive instruction about this topic. One of the reasons why we think it's important to make accessible the problem solving before instruction approach into the educational practice is that it can help promote critical thinking. It is an opportunity for students to face novel problems and try to find creative solutions for these problems. Another reason is that this experience is compatible with the teaching of the contents in class. Specifically, several studies suggest that inventing personal solutions in this initial problem can help students to activate previous knowledge, to become more aware of the knowledge gaps, to feel more motivated, and finally, to acquire a higher understanding of the contents covered and to be able to transfer this understanding.